Hello, it's Denise here, circuit pastoral worker for the Preston Ripple Circuit. So I'm filming this um, the afternoon before it's going to go out on Facebook and I'm in one of my happy places. I'm on the beach, I'm at a place called Half Moon Bay and if you look on the horizon you can probably catch a glimpse of the beautiful Lake District. I have come somewhere where I find my happiness and where I feel that I have chosen life. Choose life in order that you might live is a phrase tucked away in the Old Testament in the book of Deuteronomy. Sometimes when we get up in the morning it's difficult to motivate ourselves, it's difficult to think that we can make a difference in the world as it is, but we can, we absolutely can. I was once told a story and it was a story about um, a man that was walking along a beach and in the distance he could see someone else. They were also walking along the same beach but further along and they were stooping down and picking things up and throwing them into the sea. So intrigued, this guy went over and he said, what are you doing? And this guy said, well, I'm just, I'm picking up these starfish and I'm throwing them into the sea. And he looked around and there were hundreds and hundreds of starfish that were there and uh, they'd been washed up on the beach. And this man was walking along and he was picking one up and throwing it back into the sea. And the man said to him, but making any difference there's hundreds and hundreds of them so carefully and gently the man stooped down picked up a starfish and threw it into the sea and said it made a difference to that one don't switch off don't become hopeless and think that we can't change things that we can't make the world a better place because we can you of me. We can make a difference. I want you to choose life. I want you to find your happy place and go there. I want you to become whatever you are meant to be. So have hope in your heart today my friend. Put some joy in your step because this life is yours to live and you, you can make a difference. Shall we pray together? Pray how you feel. If you want to close your eyes, close your eyes. If you want to sit quietly, sit quietly. If you've never prayed before, pray now. Lord God, we thank you that there is hope in abundance. We thank you that there is love in the world. And however overwhelming life can be sometimes, it is good to know that you are a great, big God who makes a beautiful world for us to live in. A place of hope and joy and peace. A place where we can choose life. So I pray for you. I pray for you today. I pray sincerely. If you need to know hope and comfort you will find it. If you need to know love you will find it. If you need to know that someone cares for you. They do. Amen.